Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. This is Markeisha and today I will be sharing with you my projects for the Christmas All Year Collaboration 2024 hosted by Betty Scrap Passion 01. I will have all of the details below in the description box. So all you have to do is click on the hashtag and you can follow along and see what Christmas projects have been created. You can participate in the collaboration by simply using the hashtag. You can upload on Instagram or you can upload on YouTube. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and let's jump into today's video. I decided this time to do some uh, fun fold cards. And so this card here is called a Top Lift Fun Fold Card. I uh, also used a embossing folder here. This is an embossing folder by Doris. And this embossing folder is called Ornaments on the Side. It is very, very pretty. I love how it just adds a little bit more dimension to the top of the card. I also use a um, die by Tim Holtz. This is the Hicks die. It is the poinsettia die with the embossing folder. It is so pretty. I've used this before and I layered it quite, um, you know, with a lot of different petals. This time I kept it, you know, kind of flat there. And then I decided to just add a little red bell in the center of the uh, poinsettia. This is a um, die cut from a pack from Recollections. The paper that I use is by Paper Studio and that paper is called Plaid Tidings. Um, I did use 110 pound cardstock. I added a magnet, so as you can see, it's pretty strong. If you lift it up, there is a sentiment in the inside that says, wishing you a beautiful holiday and a wonderful new year. I do have a little ornament there um, that it's just a little sticker I had in my stash there. And so this is a really nice, fun card here. Here's the paper again on the back side of the card. And so this card is all ready to go. Got the sentiment there, all ready for Christmas. So this is the first card, guys. This is my second card here, and this card is totally Anna Griffin. The paper that I use is also Anna Griffin. This is a little foil paper pad I picked up, I believe, from Tuesday morning years ago, guys. And it just had, you know, some foil paper in there, and so I used it on the front as well as the back. This card is a 5 by 7 card. This is also an Anna Griffin die there, and I absolutely love that die. I have used it, I think only one time before, so I could wait to play with it again. And so the die is called, uh, it is a door die by Anna Griffin. And it has lots of different pieces there so you can dress up your door. Um, so I did add the little banner here with the little um, bows there. Um, I also just wanted some greenery there with the little laterns to the side there. This uh, sentiment here is also Anna Griffin. It says, may the magic of the seasons be yours. And so very, very cute, ready to go. This welcome sign little doormat, this was totally uh, inspired by Betty. She created a card um, and she used um, the welcome mat. And so I did pick this die up from TMU. All right, it's a top uh, fold card here. Relax and enjoy the holidays. Merry Christmas. And here is another little die that I used in my, uh, from my stash. This paper here has, um, you know, a lot of foil on it. And so this is a just a, a simple five by seven card. This is not, you know, really a fun fold here, but it is um, a really nice card. All right, and the last card I have is called an easy slide and lock card. I did use the same uh, paper stack by Paper Studio, the plaid tidying paper, and um, I just use a die in my stash. This sticker says, tis the season to be jolly. Then I have this little black and uh, checkered bow here, red and checkered bow here that I had. And then this is a poinsettia that someone created for me and I don't really remember, but it's so cute and tiny and I thought it would just really be fun to add to the card here. And why um, this is called an easy slide and lock card is because this here moves back and forth. And so you can slide it, position it however you want, but it just slides right off there. And when you take that off, it says, wishing you a special kind of joy that makes life good and sweet and amazing, all for you all season long. Merry Christmas. 
All right, and it closes. And I left the back with just some 110 pound cardstock. And then this just slides right back on here, guys. All right, and so here is that card. I really enjoyed making this card, and I can't wait to create some different versions of the uh, easy slide and lock cards because this was so fun and so easy, guys, um, to create. If you're hearing a little <laughs> little sound in the background, I have my little nine-month-old little uh, grandson, and he is helping me craft and make my video today. All right, guys, thanks so much for tuning in to today's video. Don't forget to go over and check out the other participants in the collaboration. And if you would like to join, just use the hashtag and join us in this crafty upload. We do upload the second Sunday of every month uh, into the end of the year. It is a all year collaboration. So you still got time to participate if you would like to get ahead of your Christmas projects. So until next time, guys, I'll talk to you in my next crafty video. Bye now. Oh,